Hey, this is Andrew Brown from ExamPro, and we'll be going over filtering data with Power BI in a simple type of filtering called a slicer. So data is the core of Power BI. As you explore reports, each visual draws its underlying data from sources that often contain far more data than you need. Filtering is a technique used to focus on a subset of data in the chart, making it easier to analyze and identify patterns or trends. Power BI offers several ways to filter and highlight reports. Knowing how to filter data is the key to finding the right information. When you filter a visual like a bar chart, you are just changing the view of the data in that visual. You are not modifying the source data in any way. Remember to keep in mind that filtering only applies to reports, not to dashboards. A simple type of filtering that you can use directly on the report page is called a slicer. Slicers provide cues to ways you can filter the results in the visuals on a report page. There are several different types of slicers, such as numeric, categorical, and date. Slicers make it easy to filter all the visuals on the page at once. So, when should you use a slicer? Well, slicers are a great choice when you want to display commonly used or important filters on the report canvas for easier access, make it easier to see the current filtered state without having to open a drop down list, filter by columns that are unneeded and hidden in the data tables. And when you want to create more focused reports by putting slicers next to important visuals, also note that Power BI slicers don't support input fields and drill down options. Explore the filters pane. Another way to filter data is by opening and modifying filters in the filters pane. The filters pane contains filters that were added to the report by the report designer. As a consumer, you can interact with the filters and save your changes, but cannot add new filters. There are four types of filters. First, we have report. This applies to all pages in the report. Then we have page. This applies to all the visuals on the current report page. Next, we have visual. This applies to a single visual on a report page. You only see visual level filters if you have selected a visual on the report canvas. And the last type of filter is drill through. This allows you to explore successively more detailed views within a single visual.